as we look to heal. And I think the only way that we can heal is through conversation. As the country continues to confront complex issues about racism and diversity, the superintendent of the Great Smoky Mountains says the National Park can help. 10 News reporter Jim Athene shows us the park superintendent is wanting to help heal with hikes. When I saw the deaths of the three African Americans, it made me very frustrated. With the nation embroiled in racial turmoil, Great Smoky Mountain Superintendent Cassius Cash stepped into a natural sanctuary on the trail. I needed to clear my head on what we're going through as a country, as a world. And I was hiking in the park and I found myself being restored, uh, being open to new perspectives. If I gained this, what would it do for my fellow community members and citizens? So Cash came up with Smokey's Hikes for Healing. You'll lead eight hikes from August to December with meaningful discussions about race and diversity in one of the most diverse ecosystems on the planet. COVID restrictions limit the hikes to only 10 people, but a group of any size can take significant steps on a lifelong journey. It is my hope that these 80 people in total will continue to have those conversations. And these conversations take quite a bit of self-awareness and self-reflection. For Cash, all the issues of the day are personal. He's the first black superintendent in Smokey's history, and his family's full of law enforcement. My father is a retired police officer, and I have two brothers, and also served as police officers. Perspectives. A lot of us have friends that have come from different places, but just simply knowing someone doesn't mean necessarily you know the shoes they've walked in. Hikes for Healing allow us to peel that back, to gain more perspective in what it is to be you. We're an important point in this country's history. And I think there would be a roll call for someone to ask, what did we do during this important time? And I want to be able to say that myself and the community around the Smokies came together to make this place better. In the Great Smoky Mountains, Jim Matheny, WBIR 10 News. And you can still apply to attend the Smokies Hikes for the Healing and also find resources about how to lead your own hikes and spark new discussions. We have those links right now at WBIR.com.